the smaller market teams that especially this season did not want to operate unless they was going to get some sort of revenue would be happy because of course they would collect fees on the expansions and they would have some sort of stability going forward until at least a vaccination comes out but also at the same time they would have to split the tv revenue among 32 teams instead of 30. So every team will be collecting less money from the national TV deal. Also, small market owners that already wanted to move their teams into high priced markets, AKA like Seattle or Las Vegas, they would probably most likely end up losing out because the league will most likely expand or possibly even expand to those markets. So teams like the Minnesota Timberwolves, I know that ownership been trying to sell the team or relocate the team. Same thing for the Sacramento Kings. There's already a lot of teams in the league where owners are losing money and they want to relocate so they'll be asked out of that another benefit is that the league could strategically relocate teams into a city with a lot of corporate money since the corporate money is more stable than jersey sales or fan ticket revenue and that can actually add to the pool of shared revenue so smaller market teams and everyone else who's struggling could benefit so if you look at a city like seattle that got amazon and other tech companies the league could sure as hell benefit from a team being there because more than likely they'll have ownerships with deep pockets that'll probably go over the luxury tax and it would add to that shared revenue pot 